Hello everybody and welcome to Wicked Tea Gaming. Today we're doing a review of Betrayal.io, a party mystery. Um, this game is similar to uh, Among Us, uh, newer. The graphics are a little different, uh, a little more cartoony. As you can see, I have my character here. There's a dressing room that you start, start in. And you can change how your character looks, rename them, do everything here. And then to jump into a game, you just go to the lobby. Now, the, uh, the first map that we that I played was, um, was since this is an alpha build was a lot like a mixture of Polis and the Scald on Among Us. It's pretty cool, uh, very large, and um, yeah, pretty big. The second map is. Pretty cool, actually. It's something very unique to these games. It's a haunted house. Um, the only thing about that is it's there's two levels. Or about to start a game. Here we go. Always a crewmate. Let's see what we got. As you can see, the map is very large. And luckily, whoever started this lobby put up the speed. And I got hit over the head with a bat. Lovely. This is still a pretty cool game. It's a vamp. Oh yeah, it was vamp. There's our little baby apple. Get him. Someone left. And as I was saying, it's a lot like Among Us, where uh, people don't really get voted out. They get launched off the planet on this one. Uh, in the Haunted House map, I'm not quite sure what happens, but it's pretty cool too. The only downside, the only negative thing I can say about this is that um, a lot of the... Uh, a lot of the tasks are very similar to Among Us, and um, but there are some very unique ones that are pretty cute, like this one where you have to join the amoebas into the larger beings. Um, also, there's um, not, I don't need the missile one. Apparently, I can do this one. Test. And then this is like the specimen one, where you have to come back in 55 seconds. But the haunted house one is pretty cool. I, I like that one a lot. Oh, adjusting cabin pressure. Nice. Um, and some of these I've never seen before. I've only ever played it one other time. Now, the one issue I have with this is that uh, the imposters, or the betrayers in this case, can call more than one, more than one um, s sabotage at a time. Um, it's pretty strange, actually. You could slow everything down, and it's weird and because the re and if you do reactor like they're doing. Oh, we get an alien abduction like we're just about to see. And there goes Killer. Killer was abducted by aliens. And that ends the game right there.
So this is uh, basically what this game is. It actually is very good. Um, I have enjoyed the a few times I've played, and um, I'm sure other people have too. And it's a browser game, so if you don't want to download Among Us or Steam or anything like that, you can just hop on to Betrayal.io and play this wonderful game. Uh, I'm going to give it uh, 4 out of 5 uh, for my review. And um, like I said, the only issue I have with it is that the betrayers can call two sabotages at the same time. Which I guess is good if there's two of them, but uh, not so good if there's only one. So... Anyway, that's uh, what I think of this game, and I hope you all get a chance to play it and make the decision for yourself. Talk to you all later. Wicked T out.